Dear students, now we are going to solve one important problem in parallel planes. Before going to solve the problem, let's discuss the formulas used in this problem. The cutoff frequency Fc is equal to m by 2a square root of mu epsilon. So here 1 by square root of mu epsilon is velocity of propagation. In case of air medium, this velocity is nothing but the velocity of light c. Its value is what? 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second. So in case of air medium, the cutoff frequency is equal to mc by 2a. Okay. Next cutoff wavelength, lambda c is equal to 2a by m. Next guided wavelength, lambda g is equal to 2 pi by beta. Beta is the phase shift constant. Okay. Next phase velocity Vp is equal to V by square root of 1 minus Fc by F the whole square. Here V is the velocity of propagation in air medium. It can be represented as the velocity of light. So here phase velocity is equal to C by square root of 1 minus Fc by F the whole square. Okay. So next one is group velocity. So here Vg is equal to V into square root of 1 minus Fc by F the whole square and then the phase shift constant beta is equal to square root of omega square mu epsilon minus m by by a the whole square. Okay and then the characteristic in B dense eta is equal to square root of mu by epsilon in air medium mu r is equal to epsilon r is equal to 1. So here we can substitute eta is equal to square root of mu naught by epsilon naught that value is 120 pi or 377 ohm okay now we are going to solve important problem in this parallel plane wave propagation for a frequency of 10 gigahertz and plane separation of 5 centimeter in air find the cutoff frequency cutoff wavelength characteristics impedance phase shift constant and velocity of propagation. Okay, so in the solution part, first we have to write the given data. Here the frequency is given as 10 gigahertz that is equal to 10 into 10 to the power 9 hertz. The separation between the planes is 5 centimeter. So here A is equal to 5 centimeter. It can also be written as 0 0.05 meter. So here the medium is here. So for air medium, mu r is equal to epsilon r is equal to 1. Here the mode of wave is not given. We can assume the given wave is TM10 mode. So here 1 is M value. So M is equal to 1. So next we are going to find out the cutoff frequency, cutoff wavelength, characteristics impedance and all the characteristics. Okay. So cutoff frequency Fc is equal to for air medium the formula is m into c by 2a. Simply we can substitute m value, a value and c values here. So 1 into 3 into 10 to the power 8 by 2 into the separation is 0 0.05. Then the answer is 3 into 10 to the power 9 hertz. So it can be represented as 3 gigahertz. Okay. So next one is cutoff wavelength. That is lambda c. Lambda c formula is 2a by yeah. So 2 into a value is 0 0.05 divided by 1. The answer is 0 0.1 meter. Okay. So the next one characteristics impedance for air medium eta is equal to square root of mu naught by epsilon naught. Mu naught value is 4 pi into 10 to the power minus 7 Henry per meter. Here epsilon naught value is 8.854 into 10 to the power minus 12 farad per meter. Then we can simplify this term. For air medium, the characteristic impedance value is always 120 pi or 377 ohm. Okay. Next, we are going to find out phase shift constant. Beta is equal to square root of omega square mu epsilon minus m by by a the whole square. So here omega is nothing but 2 pi f. Okay, so here we can write omega squared as 4 pi squared f squared 
mu naught epsilon naught minus m by by a the whole square. We can take this pi value as common from the square root. So here it is only pi. So pi into square root of 4. F squared value is 10 into 10 to the power 9 the whole square. Here mu naught value is pi into 10 to the power minus 7. Epsilon naught value is 8.854 in 10 to the power minus 12. Minus 1 by 0 0.05 the whole square. Then we can simplify all the terms. Then we can get the beta value as 200 radian per meter. Okay. So next one is phase velocity. Vp is equal to V by square root of 1 minus Fc by F the whole square. Simply we can substitute. V is nothing but the velocity of light for air medium. So 3 into 10 to the power 8 divided by square root of 1 minus. Cutoff frequency is 3 into 10 to the power 9. Correct? 3 gigahertz. Operating frequency is 10 gigahertz. Okay? Then we can get the answer as 3.145 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second. You will understand this one. And finally... The group velocity Vg is equal to V into square root of 1 minus Fc by F the whole square. Simply we can substitute all the values in this one. Then we can get that group velocity is equal to 2.862 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second. So this problem is very important. We can expect this problem in university examination. Okay.